Buenos dias, Trap Fam. Hola, como estas? We got a special holiday edition of Trap Bistro TV for you guys because we're making trap tamales. Nothing says holiday season like pumpkin spice, but if you're Mexican, nothing says holiday season like some tamales. So together with Marissa, we're gonna whip up some pumpkin spice tamales for you guys. Stay tuned and check it out. All right, mm mm mm. So we're gonna need some corn husks. Marissa got these from the Mexican market. We need some tamale mix, instant. The one that says tamale on it's good. The maseca, the instant one. If you guys don't have this one, the white bag is cool too. You guys make tortillas out of it. And we're gonna hook it up with some extra ingredients. So right here, we got a little cinnamon. Cloves, you can see that. Two cloves. Six tablespoons of brown sugar. And allspice, all right? And to that, we're gonna have some pumpkin pie mix. A little condensed milk and our tamale mix. All right, guys, let's, let's go ahead and I'll show you guys how to make the masa. Right, so before you get started, you need your tamale corn husk to soak in some hot water. So you got some hot water right there. Wow, it's like a facial steamer. You should put your face over it. All right. Go, Kevin. Do it. Here we go. Oh, now I'm all fogged up. All right. All right, Marissa, go ahead and open that up. All right, just go ahead. Stick these bad boys up in here. That's probably good. Yeah. And got that hot water coming right up. So let's go ahead and make our masa. Marissa, we're gonna need one and a half cups of the masa powder. Okay. One and a half. All right. All right, put that sugar up in there. Brown sugar. Let's put a quarter teaspoon of that baking powder. All right, let's get our spices up in there, our cinnamon, our cloves. One and a half cups of warm water. And then we need some lard. That lard is gonna give it that perfect texture and consistency and not let it get dried out. Right, and we're gonna put two thirds of a cup of lard up in there. All right, two thirds. How much is that? That's about two thirds. Yeah, yeah, that's about two thirds up in there. All right guys, now that we've got everything up in there, there's only one way to do this. We gotta just mix it up and then get in there with the hands and start kneading it up. Consistency to be like wet cookie dough. So Kevin, tell me, are you Mexican? No, I'm Vietnamese. Marissa, are you Mexican? I'm Mexipino. What's that? Oh, you can call me Filipino. <laughs> What's that? It's Mexican and Filipino put together. Oh, cool. All right, put some condensed milk up in there. You may want to put an egg up in there too. Make sure it's sweet enough. So we're putting pumpkin pie mix, some condensed milk, and we'll put an egg once we taste it and make sure it's sweet enough. All right guys, so we don't have any steamers in the trap house, but don't even trip. I'm gonna show you guys how to make a trap steamer, all right? So get your pot, and you're just gonna wrap up some aluminum foil balls and put it in the bottom. That way when you put the water in, it doesn't touch the bottom of your tamales or whatever else you're steaming, all right? Very cool. So Marissa, let's go ahead and make some trap steamers. All right, let's do it. You don't need to go out and buy a lot of stuff to put it. That's not what Trap Easter is all about. We're about using what you got at home or things you can get from the dollar store or in prison. I lay the tamales on top just like that. All right, guys. Now I'm going to show you how to make these corn husks and these pumpkin pie filling and this masa into what we're going to eat, tamales. So go ahead and get your corn husk out. It's been soaking for about an hour. And just make sure it's dry, you know, not too much excess moisture up in there, okay? Yep. All right, All Marissa. Right. Smear a little bit of this guy on there. And what is this called? This is the pumpkin masa. Oops. Now this is more like a dessert tamale. Yeah, this is a sweet tamale. Mm -hmm. You can make all sorts of meat fillings and stuff like that. All right, we got a little bit of masa up on there, nice and smooth and moist, not all dry. Marissa, a little pumpkin. 
you guys can check out Marissa and I making a prison tamale and her first taste test of that. Yes. Do you like a lot of sauce or a little bit? No, just a little bit. Okay, you're gonna do the wrapping. It's okay. Yeah, that's, that's a good tamale. That's a fat tamale right there. And it's gonna be like that. Yes. Go ahead and let's just put that in the steamer. There, and you wanna steam it, put it face up, like standing up. Like this, guys. This in your trap steamer. Go ahead and just put them facing up, okay? Just like that. All right, guys, now we'll go ahead and put it on our stove. Put a little bit of water up in there and go ahead and start steaming it for about half an hour to an hour. So this ones don't take as long because they're not meat in this side, they're just pumpkin pie spice. Have you done this before, Kevin? Not real tamales, only prison tamales. I'll put the link in the description. You guys can check out Marissa and I making a prison tamale and her first taste test of that. All right, Marissa. <laughs> Go ahead and taste that oh, trap molly. Oh, look at this trap molly. And I can see the pumpkin in there. Yeah, you can see all that pumpkin pie filling. Cinnamon. So good. Oh my goodness, I think I'm going to like it. Mmm. Who would ever know? That is good. Like, that is so good. This is so good. Yeah. This is a great dessert. That masa tastes kind of like brown sugar cinnamon oatmeal, like the Quaker instant yeah, stuff. It does. And the inside, the inside tastes like pumpkin pie filling. And who doesn't love that? We should put some cream cheese inside of it. Let's put some cream cheese inside. Oh. Some whipped cream on top. Oh mm, my gosh, you guys need to make this. It's so good. Yeah, the pumpkin it's pie filling. It's so good. I'm going to eat it all up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the pumpkin pie filling is all moist and it's bomb. I'm not dried out. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. This is the best. Who would have thought to put pumpkin pie tamales. Only you. Only trapeze Yeah. This is so good. Oh wow. Mm. Bomb. Bomb.com. So good. I hope this year while you guys are making tamales go ahead and throw a few pumpkin spice ones in there too. Let us know how you guys like it. Until next time, trapeze out. <laughs> oh wow, All that's right. good. That was good.